on, y'all. Welcome back to the channel. So get ready to jump in the dually, head on over to Okeechobee, Florida for Muddy Valentine's Day over at Plant Bamboo Mud Park, hosted by Trust Gone Wild. It's gonna be a super bitching event. At least, I think so, it hadn't happened yet. It's got all familiar symptoms, being a super bitching event. They got mud bogging, they got truck tug of wars, they got freaking swamp buggy races, freaking bikini contests, wet t-shirt contests, you name it, it's at that motherfucking park. It is party time, y'all. And as motherfucking usual, we are running freaking seriously behind. I was supposed to leave at 11 a.m., it is now about two o'clock. <laughs> Whoops, oh well. Well, let's go ahead and get this freaking drive out of the way, and it's motherfucking party time. And you know what, before we get this drive out of the way, no time like the present for y'all to go ahead and slam that freaking like button down there at the bottom of the screen and hit that subscribe button down there in my channel name. That way you get notified when I upload any other videos. Like more truck tug of war videos. <laughs> tech talk videos. So, we're gonna go with two turbochargers. Freaking mud bogging videos. <laughs> All kinds of super bitch stuff always hit in the channel, so make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can be part of the action sales. Right out, out over yonder, we got our super bitchin' camping rig all dialed in, ready to rock in, mother frickin' roll. This is actually our first time that we're gonna be hauling the 40-foot gooseneck setup with the camper rig and mega truck with our new super mother frickin' bitchin' killing at Denali. That's right, take a look at our new tow pig. She is so damn pretty. She's a 2024 GMC Denali HD 3500 with a friggin' Allison transmission and 6.6 liter Duramax diesel engine. Thing is so mother frickin' sick and gone. I tell you what, the whole rig looks pretty bitchin'. I mean, I'm, I ain't gonna lie. I mean, it looked good before with the with the old tow pig, but go go, killing Nally really freaking turns it up. But I've been wrenching my balls off once again trying to get old girl ready for this mud bogging event, and as usual, didn't really get everything done that I wanted to get done. But I got a lot of stuff done. Uh, one of the main things that I got completed, we actually can't see from this side. Hold on, let's walk on over to the other side. And as we're making our walk, take a look at our freaking super bitch and sponsor setup. That's right. We added a couple ones for the last couple of events. We got VP Race Fuels hooking us up with all kinds of super killing and juice to be able to put in the killing mega truck. We've got fast diesel fuel systems hooked us up with our super bitch and lift pump. You can actually see it right on over yonder. We got our boy, Mr. Daryl from AutoWorks of Venice that helped us rig our compound turbo SoCal diesel mother freaking killing at Duramax. And our boy, Mark with MTKB Racing that does all of our tuning on the killing at mega truck. That's right. Tailgate is getting a little loaded, I ain't gonna lie. We are super fortunate to have everybody that puts up with our shit. <laughs> but that is the last thing I've been wrenching on. If y'all didn't get a chance to check that video out, I go through and explain it. It's actually the video that came out just before this one. And I explain how I redid all the brake lines with stainless steel hard brake lines. I do have a little bit of stainless steel braided brake line that's ran in certain areas. But a lot of it is ran through hard brake line. And it all comes together with our super badass freaking RD Concepts brake manifold that the mad scientist done hooked us up with. God, that thing is so mother freaking pretty. But we are ready to rock and roll, y'all. It's party time. So let's get in the dually, get this freaking drive out of the way so we can start having some fun at the mud park. Oh, yeah. It's freaking go time. Freaking stoke. I freaking love this mud park. So badass because the mud is so awesome. And the holes, there's nothing that's going to surprise you and completely eat your truck. It's uh, usually some really badass mud bogging. This is definitely new. Every time that I've got here, like the past like six events that I've came, I get here like late at night at like midnight, one in the morning, and there's no freaking line at all. So this is the first time I've ever had to wait in line here. All right, y'all, we have officially made it to Plant Bamboo Muddy Valentine, hosted by Trust Gone Wild. Just got the campers all set up. Let me, let me give you all a little look before I finish getting my stuff. So got my super bitchy camping rig all set up. The mad scientist got us a super banging spot. Right on back here in the back little 40 with his super bitch and freaking motorhome. Check out his new motorhome. It is so nasty. I absolutely love it. And he says that if I get a trailer big enough, big bumper pull, then he'll put both our trucks on it and haul us to any event we want to go to. There he is. Hey, what's up? Isn't that right, Brian? Yes. All I got to do is get a bumper pull trailer big enough and you'll haul both our trucks to any event we want to go to. For sure. <laughs> Ah, well, I'll just cut that out of the video. <laughs> Got our rigs all posted up. So we're going to ice down the coolers. 
head on over the main mod hole and start watching the people tear their stuff up. It's freaking go time. <laughs>
friends that are with me. Oh, Cummins, out Cummins! Bring it in.
Well, y'all, your boy may or may not have goofed up a little bit. I had some potentially upsetting circumstances. The uh, onboard camera that I usually keep in the Killing It Mega Truck that I had going when we did some of our mud bogging, it is no longer part of the Killing It Party. I'm not sure where the hell it is. Um, it Either somebody stole it off my truck, which I doubt. I don't think anybody would do that. I hope nobody would do that. Or it flung off when I hit a mud hole, just a little too froggy. So, I mean, it's not a big deal because honestly, I didn't really do that much mud bogging in this event. Hit a couple holes pretty good, but there wasn't really a whole lot of mudding that was really my brand of whiskey. There was just that deep ass water hole, which is whatever. It's kind of cool to watch. And then there was some really, really nasty mud that I made like a truck length into it and then just sank. And I tried again. I just say it was kind of a waste of time. Not really that cool. But other than that, there was a couple other little smaller holes that I did video ripping through. But like I said, that camera's no longer part of the killing the party. So one of you lucky freaking spectators that are going to Plant Bamboo Mud Park in the next little bit, if you come across a little black camera, it's your boys. Might have some good footage on there of us ripping through some mud, adrenaline ripping through some mud, and our buddy Slow Motion Logan ripping through a little bit of mud. But luckily, I do keep a couple of those cameras in my camper, and I realized it right before we went to the truck tug of wars. So the next video that's going to come out right after this one is all the truck tug stuff. So we do have some onboard footage from doing that. And... Well, let's be honest, that's my favorite thing to do anyway. So I look at the glass half full. But yeah, we don't really have any onboard footage of us doing any mud bogging because uh, that camera's gone. But to round out this video though, Trucks Gone Wild did set up a pretty badass like dirt drag strip at the front of Plant Bamboo Mud Park. They had some mud trucks doing some dirt drags. They had some swamp buggies doing some drags. And we had a couple YouTube celebrities show up and do a couple little rips. So the next part of the video is going to go ahead and head on over to that. I didn't really know too much about the different swamp buggies and the different drivers and everything because this is the first time I've ever seen swamp buggy racing at a park. So more of it's just watching the guys do the rips. But uh, that's what we're going to do now. So sorry again, y'all. We didn't have any onboard footage, but whatever. Part of it. Moving forward. horsepower uh 1200 on gas 1800 on nitrous 1800 jesus and i think we're gonna take a little walk around and check out some of these other ones because they are freaking badass looking That thing's a rig too. It's called Freak on a Leash, and apparently it's going to do something real cool.
chasing him apparently. <laughs> Parker's got his Hellcat. Freaking doll moment at the mud park, right? Y'all, who the hell brings a Hellcat to the mud park? Freaking Parker Mitchell, that's who. So I've brought, I brought him up a couple times in some of my other videos. He's been starting to come around and starting to hang out with us a bit more at some of these mud truck events. But he's got, it's a 2016 Hellcat, and he's got all kinds of shit done to this thing. Obviously, he's got the doors removed, a little light waiting for racing. I think that's what it's for. And uh, he's got a blower on it, pistons, rods. I think it's a 3.0 wibble charger is what he was telling me it was. But the player cards, right, maybe if I talk real nice next time we see him at a mud park, he'll give us a little rundown of what all he's done to this thing because it's pretty cool. It's a freaking unit. It rips. He says it's the world's highest mile Hellcat. It's got 180 plus thousand miles on it. Pretty freaking cool. Well, we'll save that for another video. But anyways, that's going to wrap up our video at Muddy Valentine at Plant Bamboo, hosted by Trust Gone Wild over in Okeechobee, Florida. Hopefully you all liked the video. Hopefully you all learned a little something. And as always, thanks for watching, y'all. And hey, keep an eye out because the next video coming out is going to be all the truck tug of war stuff from this event. And as you all know, that's my mother freaking jam. But anyways, hope you all enjoyed the video. And as always, thanks for watching, y'all. If you all enjoyed the video and want to check out future videos, subscribe to our channel. Hit that button right there. While you're at it, hit the like button at the bottom of your screen. You can also check out our website, killingitlifestyle.com. There you can follow the Killing It crew and order your own apparel so everyone will know you're killing it! Yeah.